Presentation Plus is available exclusively with the new 4th edition of Interchange, the most widely used and the most successful English course in the world, incorporating video, audio, and even online resources, all with the click of a mouse. With Presentation Plus, your students will be laser focused on the task at hand as you use the built-in presentation tools to highlight key concepts, reveal answers to exercises, annotate passages, play class audio passages and video segments, and even embed web links right into your lessons. Let us show you how Presentation Plus can help you deliver more engaging and effective lessons. Visit the link below or contact your Cambridge University Press representative for a demonstration today. How do you answer the workbook? First, watch the explanations video. Then, Answer three pages of the workbook by yourself. Finally, check the answers and see the correction. Interchange Intro Fourth Edition Workbook Answers Unit 1. A time to remember. Exercise 1. A. In this video, you should 1. Watch the explanation video. Then, watch the grammar video of Mr. Kyle Relson. Finally, answer 3 pages of the workbook. Half unit and check the answer at the end. Unit 1 A time to remember. Exercise 1 A. Verb past. B. Was. Where. Become. Became. Do. Dead. Email. Emailed. Get. Got. British. Got. American got, have, had, hide, head, laugh, laughed, the estas sound, laugh, laughed, lose, lost, move, moved, open, opened, scream, screamed. B. My best friend in school was Michael. He and I were in Mrs. Gilbert's third grade class, and we became friends. We often did crazy things in class, but I don't think Mrs. Gilbert ever really got mad at us. For example, Michael had a pet monkey named Bananas. Sometimes he hid it in Mrs. Gilbert's desk. Later, later, when she opened the drawer, she always screamed. She always screamed loudly, and the class laughed. After two years, Michael's family moved to another town. We emailed each other for a few years, but then we lost contact. I often wonder, what's he doing now? So the answers of exercise number 1b was... Where, became, dead, got, had, head, opened, screamed, laughed, moved, email, lost. Exercise 2. Exercise 2 answers. 
No, I wasn't born there. Actually, I'm originally from Portugal. Portugal, a country in Europe. That's interesting. E silent. So, when did you move to Brazil? When did you move to Brazil? I moved to Brazil when I was in elementary school. When I was in elementary school. Where did you live? We lived in Recife. It's a beautiful city in northeast Brazil. Then I went to college. Did you go to school in Recife? Did you? Did you go? No, I went to school in Sao Paulo. And what did you study? Did you study? And what did you study? Oh, I studied engineering, but I am here to go to gra to graduate school. But I am here to go to graduate school. Great. When did you arrive? When did you arrive? I arrived last week. I start school in three days. Well, good luck and sorry for all the questions. Exercise 3. Answers will vary. Exercise 3. Any answer is correct. Different answers. Exercise 4. A. Rodrigo. Rodrigo Santoro is from Petropolis. Petropolis near Rio de Janeiro. Near Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. He's an actor. He's an actor. B. 1. False. Rodrigo Santoro studied communication at university. Rodrigo Santoro studied communication at university. 2. True. 3. True. 4. False. He was nominated for an MTV movie award for the role of King Xerx. He was nominated for an MTV movie award for the role of King Xerx. 5. False. He plays many different roles such as young men in a mental hospital, a king, and a president. 6. True. Exercise number 5. 2. My favorite pet was a cat called Felix. A, a cat. 3. We used to go to summer camp during our vacations. It was really fun. 3. Summer camp. 4. There was a great playground in our neighborhood. We used to go there every afternoon. 4. Playground. Exercise number 6. Answers will vary. Possible answers. 2. They also used to ride bicycles. Their dog, Bruno, always used to follow them. 2. He used to ride bicycles. He used to. 3. Kate used to go to the beach every weekend during summer vacation. She hardly ever goes now. 3. He used to go to the beach. 4. Peter. Peter used to collect comic books. They are now worth a lot of money. 4. He used to collect comic books. 5. They used to have a pet rabbit. They don't have any pets now. 5. He used to have a pet rabbit. Exercise number 7. 2. Did you? Did you used to collect shells? Did you used to collect shells? No. No, we didn't collect shells. We used to build sand castles. D. Silent. Castles. 3. Did you used to swim? Did you used to swim? Yes. Yes, we did. We used to swim for hours. Then we played all kinds of sports. 4. Really? What kind of sports did you used to play? Or, what sports did you used to play? Well, we used to play beach volleyball 
with some other kids. Did you used to lose? Did you used to lose? No, we didn't. We used to win. No, we didn't. We used to win. Exercise number eight. Answers will vary. Exercise number nine. Maria. Maria, I am an immigrant here. I was born in Chile and grew up there. Grew up. I came here in 2005. I wasn't very happy at first. Things were difficult for me. I didn't speak English. So, I went to a community college and studied English there. And I studied English there. My English got better. American got. British got. My English got better. My English got better. And I found this job. What about you? Exercise 9 answers was Grew up K Wasn't Where Didn't speak When Studied Got Found Exercise 10 2. Tell me a little about yourself Tell me a little about yourself What do you want to know? What do you want to know? What do you want to know? How old were you when you moved here? About 16. About 16. Did you? Did you learn English here? No. I studied in Morocco. I studied in Morocco. By the way, I am Lisa. Glad to meet you. Glad to meet you. Unit 2. Code in the Rush. Unit 2 Workbook Answers. Exercise 1. 2. Bus Stop. 3. Bicycle Lane. 4. Traffic Jam. 5. News Stand. 6. Taxi Stand. Exercise 2. A. 2. Dark streets. Install modern street lights. Install modern street lights. 3. No places to take children. Build more parks. 4. Crime. Hire more police officers. 5. Car accidents. Install more traffic lights. 6. Traffic jams. Build a subway system. Build a subway system. Exercise 2 B. 2. There are too many car accidents. The city should install more traffic lights. 3. There are too many traffic jams. The city should build a subway system. 4. There is too much crime. The city should hire more police officers. 5. There aren't enough places to take children. The city should build more parks. 6. There are too many dark streets. The city should install modern street lights. C. There should be fewer car accidents. 3. There should be fewer traffic jams. 4. There should be less crime. 5. There should be more places to take children. 6. There should be fewer dark streets. Exercise 3. A. 2. Business district. 3. Commuter lines. 4. Parking garages. 5. Police officers. 6. Public transportation. 7. Rush hour. Exercise 3 B. Life in this city needs to be improved. 
Life in the city needs to be improved. To be yeah, yes, yes, and to be improved. For one thing, there are too many cars, and there is too much bad air, especially during rush hour. The air pollution is terrible. The air pollution is terrible. This problem is particularly bad downtown, in the business district. Too many pop. Too many people drive their cars to work. I think, I think there should be more police officers at busy intersections. I think there should be more police officers at busy intersections. They could stop traffic jams. We also need fewer parking garages downtown. The city spends too much money building them. It's so easy to park that too many people drive to work. However, the city doesn't spend enough money on public transportation. There aren't enough commuter lines to the suburbs. C. Answers will vary. Exercise four. A. One. Tram. Two. Ferry. Three, subway. Four, cable railway. Cable railway. B. How old is it? Cable railway, ferry, subway, tram. Two. How many people use it? How safe is it? Where can you go up? So in this exercise, we can get the answers one by one. Cable railway over 120 years old. Ferry NG, subway NG, tram since 1904. How many people use it? Two. How many people use it? Cable railway, NG. Ferry, NG. Not given. Subway, 2.3 million a day. Tram, 230,000 a day. 230,000 a day. Four. How safe is it? Never been an accident. Ferry, very safe. Subway, NG, tram, NG, not given. 4. Where can you go? Up Victoria Peak, Hong Kong Island, Kowloon, other islands, Macau, Gongadong. Airport, all the major centers. 30 kilometers of street on Hong Kong Island. 30 kilometers of streets on Hong Kong Island. Exercise number 5. 2. Can you tell me where the buses are? Yeah, there's a bus stop just beside this building. A bus stop. 3. Do you know where I can change my money? There is a money, there is a money exchange on the second floor. There is also an ATM over there, ATM. 4. Do you know what time the last train leaves for the city? No, but I can check the schedule. 5. Could you tell me where the taxi stand is? Sure, just follow that sign. Just follow that sign. Sign, G silent, sign. Exercise number six, a conversation between clerk and guest. Sure, the gym is on the 19th floor. Okay, and can you tell me where the coffee shop is? And can you tell me where the coffee shop is? Yes, the coffee shop is next to the gift shop. The gift shop 
Hmm. I need to buy something for my wife. Do you know when the gift shop closes? It closes at 6 p.m. I am sorry, but you will have to wait until tomorrow. It's already 6.15. Okay. Oh, I'm expecting a package. Could you call me when it arrives? Don't worry. Don't worry. American Don. Don't worry. I'll call you when it arrives. I'll call you when it arrives. Thanks. Just one more thing. Do you know how often the airport bus leaves? Do you know how often? Do you know how often the airport bus leaves? The airport bus leaves every half an hour. Every half hour. Anything else? No, I don't think so. Thanks. Exercise number seven, two. We need less traffic downtown. We need less traffic downtown. Three. Could you tell me where the subway station is? Could you tell me where the subway station is? Four. There aren't enough parking garages. There should be more parking garages. Five. Do you know how often the bus comes? Do you know how often the bus comes? Six. Can you tell me what time the last train leaves? Can you tell me what time the last train leaves? Question number eight. Answers will vary. That's the end of unit number two. Interchange two, unit two. Unit three. Time for a change. Exercise one. A. Two. Cramped. Spacious. Dangerous. Safe. Big. Small, bright, dark, modern, old, quiet, noisy, cheap, expensive. Exercise 1. B. The rooms are too dark. 3. The living room is too cramped for the family. Or... The living room is too small for the family. 4. The bathroom is not modern enough. 5. The yard is too small for our pets. 6. The street is not quiet enough for us. 7. The neighborhood is not safe enough. 8. The location is too inconvenient. The location is too inconvenient. Exercise 2. 2. There aren't enough bedrooms. 3. It's not modern enough. 4. There aren't enough parking spaces. 5. The neighborhood doesn't have enough street lights. 6. There aren't enough closets. 7. It's not private enough. 8. The living room is not spacious enough. Exercise number 3. That's true. The house is less convenient. And the apartment doesn't have as many rooms as the house. Yes, the house is more spacious. The house is more spacious. But I think, but I think there are just as many closets as in the apartment. You're right. The closet space is the same. The wallpaper in the apartment, the wallpaper in the apartment is not as shabby as the wallpaper in the house. I know. But he could change the wallpaper in the house. Hmm. The rent on the apartment is almost as expensive as or not as expensive as the rent on the house. But the house is much bigger. Oh, I can't decide. Can you show me something else?
Exercise 4 A. Answers will vary. B. Answers will vary. Possible answer. I live in a nice neighborhood. It's quiet and the people are friendly. There is a large park with a lake and lots of trees nearby. However, there aren't enough shops or restaurants. There aren't enough shops. Shops, British, American, shops. O as a sound. There aren't enough shops or restaurants. My apartment is comfortable and bright, but it's cramped. The rooms are too small and there isn't enough closed space. However, it's pretty convenient. For example, I have my own washing machine. Exercise number 5. B. Be healthy. Be happier. No. Italian. Karate. Karate American. British Karat. Have. More free time. My own room. Move. Move somewhere else. Move to new place. B. I wish I had my own room. I wish I knew karate. I wish I had more free time. I wish I were happier. I wish I knew Italian. I knew. Exercise 6. 2. A. I wish I could retire. I know what you mean. I know what you mean. Where do you want to move? Somewhere else. 4. I wish I could find a bigger apartment. It's very nice though. Exercise number 7. 2. This neighborhood is not dangerous. Or, this neighborhood is not too dangerous. 3. My apartment is not private enough. 4. Our house has just as many bedrooms as yours. 5. I wish I had more clothes space. Or, I wish I had enough clothes space. 6. We wish we could move somewhere else. Or, we wish we lived somewhere else. 7. That apartment is not big enough. 8. I wish housework were not difficult. Exercise number 8. A. Italy, China, Turkey. Turkey. Exercise number 8b. One. People make wishes only once a year. Turkey. Two. You need a lock and key. A lock. British a lock. You need a lock and key. Hongshan. Three. You put your wish on a tree. Turkey. 4. You need a coin to make your wish. Rome. 5. Wish making is only for couples. Hongshan. 6. The money from the wishes goes to poor people. Rome. Some people make their wishes on the internet. Turkey. Unit 4. I have never heard of that. Exercise 1. Andy and Isabel. Yes. Yes, I have. It's beautiful. Did you go there on the weekend? Yeah, I did. I went on Sunday. I got up at 4 a.m. I got up. American got up. O as a sound t asafadi. Wow, I've never woken up that night. Oh, it wasn't so bad. I got to the beach early to see, to see the sun come up. I got to the beach early to see the sun come up. Have you ever seen a sunrise on a beach, Andy? 
Have you ever seen the sun rise on a beach, Andy? No, I haven't. Then I went swimming around six o'clock. But there were some strange dark shadows in the water. Have you ever heard of sharks at sunshine at sunrise beach? Have you ever heard of sharks at Sunrise Beach? Yes, I have. I heard a news report about sharks last summer. Gee, maybe I had a lucky escape on Sunday morning. Why don't you come with me next time? Are you kidding? Exercise 2 A. Answers will vary. B and C. Answers will vary. Possible answers. 2. Have you ever eaten raw fish? Yes, I have. I ate some yesterday. I really liked it. 3. Have you ever tried Indian food? Yes, I have. I tried some in Indian restaurant last month. It was great. 4. Have you ever traveled abroad? Yes, I have. I went to Russia last summer. I loved it. 5. Have you ever ridden a motorcycle? Yes, I have. I rode my brother's motorcycle. Exercise 3. A. Sweets. Fish. Milk. Cheese. Tomatoes. Tomatoes. T. Soft D. Tomatoes. Bread, pasta, and pasta can cause food allergies. B and C. Problem, what didn't work, what worked. Avir Lewis, Sharon, Fred. Lewis, problem. Headaches, stomach aches. What didn't work, taking medicine, not eating sweets. What work? Not eating fish. Sharon. Problem? Sore mouth. What didn't work? Not drinking milk. Not eating cheese. What work? Not eating tomatoes. Fred. Problem? Swollen hands. Not able to hold his tools. Swollen hands. Not able to hold his tools. What didn't work? Taking medicine. What worked? Not eating bread or pasta. Exercise 4. A. Four, two, one, three, five. One. First, slice the mushrooms. Then, Beat the eggs in a bowl. Next, add salt and pepper to the egg mixture. After that, pour the eggs into frying pan, add the mushrooms and cook. Finally, fold the omelet in half. Your omelet is ready. Enjoy! B. Answers will vary. Possible answers. How to cook? Scrambled eggs. First, mix two eggs in a cup. Then, heat some butter in a frying pan. Next, pour the egg mixture into the pan. After that, cook slowly for about 3 minutes and stir the egg mixture once or twice with a spoon. Finally, pour the scrambled eggs onto a plate. Exercise 5 Jason Sylvia Really? I've never eaten Thai food. I've never eaten. Oh, you should try it. It's delicious. What did you order? What did you order? First, I had soup with green curry and rice. Then, I tried pad Thai. It's noodles, shrimp, and vegetables in spicy sauce. 
I haven't tested it pad thai. I haven't tested it pad thai before. Was it very hot? No, it was just spicy enough. And after that, I ate bananas in coconut milk for dessert. Hmm, that sounds good. It was. Exercise 6. 2. I had a huge lunch, so I skipped dinner. 3. What ingredients do you need to cook crispy fried noodles? What ingredients do you need to cook crispy fried noodles? First, fry the beef in oil and curry powder, and then pour the coconut milk over the beef. 5. We need to leave the restaurant now. Could we have the check, please? Exercise 7 1. Have you ever tried barbecue chicken? You marinate the meat in barbecue sauce for about an hour and then cook it on the grill. Hmm, that sounds good. 2. Here is a recipe called packed eggplant. Delight. Here is a recipe called packed eggplant delight. I usually bake eggplant for an hour, but this says you bake it for only five minutes. That sounds strange. 3. Look at this dish. Frog's legs with bananas. I have never seen that before. Yuck. That sounds awful. Exercise number 8. Crossword puzzle. Crossword puzzle. One bean broke brought brought both British American bought. Made skipped five skipped six forgot forgot British forgot seven driving driving eight took took nine tried tried ten had, had, eleven, given, given, twelve, written, written, thirteen, eighteen, eighteen, fourteen, decided, 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 Enter change 2 for sedition. Unit 5 workbook answers. Going places. Exercise 1. A. Take. Long walks. Take sailing lessons. Take a vacation. Do. Lots of hiking. Do some fishing. Do something exciting. Go. Go camping. Go swimming. Go on vacation. Rent. Rent a camper. Rent a car. Rent a condominium. Catch up on. Catch up on my email. Catch up on my reading. Catch up on my studying. Catch up on my studying. B. Answers will vary. C. Answers will vary. Exercise 2. Dave, Stella. I'm going to rent a car and take a long drive. 
I'm gonna rent a car. I'm going to rent a car. I'm gonna. I'm gonna rent a car. Where are you going to go? I'm not sure. I'll probably visit my sister Joanne. Probably. Also, probably. I haven't seen her in a long time. That sounds nice. I'd like to visit my family too. Yes. And maybe I'll go to the mountains for a few days. And maybe I'll go to the mountains for a few days. I haven't been hiking in months. How about you? Are you going to do anything else on your vacation? I'll probably catch up on my studying. I have a lot of work to do before school starts. That doesn't sound like much fun. Oh, I am planning to have some fun too. I'm gonna relax on the beach. I love to swim in the ocean. Exercise number three. A. How are you going to get there? I'm gonna drive. Where are you going to stay? Where are you gonna stay? Where are you going to stay? Where are you gonna stay? I'm gonna stay in a condominium. My friend has one near the beach. Are you going to travel with anyone? Are you gonna travel with anyone? No, I'm gonna travel by myself. B. Two. Maybe I'll take the train. Three. I'm not going to stay in a hotel. Four. I think I'll ask a friend. I think I'll ask a friend. Exercise four. A. Answers will vary. Possible answers. Tourists can see beautiful nature scenes at Garlov and Corcovado Mountains outside of Rio de Janeiro and at Iguazo Falls. B. 1. True. 2. False. Buenos Aires has the widest avenue in the world. 3. False. Iguazu Falls is bigger than Niagara Falls. 4. True. 5. False. Rio de Janeiro has parks and beaches. Buenos Aires and Iguazu Falls have parks. Exercise number 5 2. Should never leave cash in your hotel room 2. Leave 3. You need to take your credit card with you To take 4. You have to pay an airport tax To pay 5. Should let your family know where they can contact you Let 6. We'd better not go out alone late at night. Go. 7. You must get a vaccination if you go to some countries. If you go to some countries, get. Exercise 6. A. 2. Hiking boots. A first aid kit. Suitable clothes. B. Exercise 6B. Answers will vary possible answers. 2. They should take hiking boots. 3. They need to take a first aid kit. 4. He ought to take suitable clothes. Exercise number 7. Answers will vary. Possible answers. 2. You must buy good quality cam camping equipment. You must buy you must buy good quality camping equipment. 3. You ought to buy maps and travel guides. 4. You'd better not forget a first aid kit. 5. You shouldn't forget your passport or identification. 6. You should get a GPS device for your car. 7. You shouldn't pack a lot of luggage. You shouldn't pack a lot of luggage. 8. You should remember to bring insect spray. 9. You must remember to bring a jacket. 10. You need to take a credit card. 11. You don't have to take a lot of cash. 12. You'd better take your driver's license.
Exercise number eight. I'm not going to go on vacation alone. I'm not going to. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna go on vacation alone. On vacation alone. I won't travel by myself. Three. Should travel with a friend. Four. You must get a vaccination. You must get a vaccination. Exercise number nine, part A. Answers will vary. Possible answer. I'm gonna I'm gonna arrive in Lisbon, Portugal, on July sixth, and check in at the at the Tivoli Hotel. Then maybe I'll go shopping. I'm gonna spend three days in Lisbon sightseeing. Then I'm gonna take a tour bus across the border to Seville in Spain. Maybe I'll visit the cathedral. I'll visit the cathedral. Cathedral, big church. I'm gonna see some flamenco dancing in the evening. Next, I'm gonna rent a car and drive to Malaga on the Costa del Sol. I'm gonna rent, I'm gonna hire. I think you'll visit the old city center and spend time on the beach. I'm gonna fly to Madrid on July 19th. I'll probably visit some museums. I'm gonna take a tour of the city and see the sights. Finally, I'm gonna go home on July 22nd. B. Answers will vary. Different answers. 2. They have to get a passport. Get a passport. American, get a, get a passport. 3. I should get a student ID card. 4. I ought to check the weather. 5. I must make hotel reservations. That's the end of units. 1 to 5 workbook for entry change 2. Hope you like it, share it, and subscribe. Wish you all good luck. Share videos. It's a community. We're all doing this together.